There's an F-350 4x4 Ford, 7.3 power stroke diesel with a Lance 12 foot truck camper. Has a hitch extension, it's not a torque lift. It also has the compression struts on the front of the camper, if you can see there on the hood, between the hood and the front of the camper to reduce some of the bouncing. Cargo carrier up top. It also has a satellite dish on the other side. Two awnings. It looks to be about an 1172. There appears to be a custom truck camper, custom made truck camper on a uh, Toyota Tundra chassis. Here's a KZ Sportsman 801 with some interesting jacks. They're fold away, folding away jacks. I've never seen those before. And the dump valves on the end of the truck like that. I've never seen them actually like that before either. I've never even seen a KZ truck hamper before. So there you go. It's sitting on a 4x4 Ford F-350. Long bed crew cab truck. And we have a Northern Light truck camper. A newer one in the distance. That looks to be about a nine, a nine foot six. I don't think it's a 10 too. I think it's more like a nine six. It does have the Dometic thermal pane windows on it. It's a newer one. I think it's got Canadian plates on it. Go Canada. Here's a really nice truck, in my humble opinion. It's a late 90s F350 Dually two-wheel drive crew cab power stroke 7.3 diesel truck. This is a very unique vehicle with it being the crew cab. This is a, uh, a very, very highly sought after truck because it has the crew cab with the 7.3 power stroke turbo diesel and it is the older body style which is a popular style among many it's a very nice truck it has uh, dual tanks on it that's the only thing that I'm not a fan of is dual tanks I prefer to have one single tank my truck has a one single 36 gallon tank these are about the same amount of gallons. They're just split up in a dual configuration. All right, so we have a nice Arctic Fox. That's about a 12 foot camper on a nice one ton dually two wheel drive truck, it looks like with a uh, torque lift super hitch extension. That looks like a four foot extension. That's the longest one that torque lifts makes. Pulling a nice Arima boat. Here's a cool Dodge in the parking lot here. It's got flames on it. I like that. Let's take a look at this bumper on this thing. That's a pretty awesome bumper. Road Armor 